everyone. I hope you guys are all having an awesome day. I'm here to share with you today a 6x6 six six, uh, sympathy card. And I just used some um, white, I think it's the Hobby Lobby or Recollections, the 12x12 12 12 paper just cut in half. So I just used the white. And the paper pad that I used is from Tuesday morning and it's the Maggie Holmes Crepe Paper Flea Market 6x6 six six paper pad, and I really, really like this paper. I'm sure you guys have seen this or probably have this. Um, really, really pretty. Love the colors. Love all the weathered wood and that kind of thing. Um, so what I did was just use my Tim Holtz distressing tool and layered a couple of the pages, and then used my sewing machine around the edge, which... This was my first card that I did use the sewing machine on and I was like hooked right off the bat. I had a feeling I would be because you guys, when you guys show your, your projects with the sewing, I absolutely go crazy. I love it. It just adds so much. And not only that, it's just fun to do. It just was a lot of fun. So now that I have my craft room somewhat together and I have a place for my sewing machine, it's a lot easier for me to just sit down and do that. So hopefully we'll be doing that more often. And then I just use my, my fingers to just kind of fold down some of the edges to give it a more distressed look. And then I used my Martha Stewart Loop Punch. I think it's a loop, called a Loop Punch. I apologize, it's not right here. And then just put that down the side there to the right. And used my Spellbinders Floral Oval dies and um, used three of the sizes and um, then layered up some flowers um, and those are recollections, some from my local store and some wild orchid crafts. And this card, it's hard to, to see the um, shimmer, I think, looking through the viewfinder here. Um, you can see a little bit of it, but this card, it's not doing any justice. It's really, really pretty in person. Um, really was pleased with the way this one came out, like the colors. Um, and then I used the smallest, or not the smallest, the third to the smallest um, Spellbinder floral oval. And then I cut two of them and then did dimensionals in between. And then I had stamped Deepest Sympathy. And I was happy to use my Hobby Lobby Paper Studio clear stamp set, this one here that a lot of us have. And I've been trying to use what I have. I, I have been shopping more than I should, but still trying to... Um, use what I have. And then down in the bottom left hand corner here is this um, really pretty memory box die that Shonda had got me. Thank you Shonda. And this is um, the Macarena corner and it's so pretty. Um, really love it. It's kind of subtle there but I think it just adds a nice touch. And um, then I used my Recollections enamel dots here, just nothing too fancy, but I like these. It's the first time I've used those out of that pack, so that was fun. And then on the inside, I used my um, the same paper, and I distressed it, folded it down after I had sewn around the edge. And then I just used the My Favorite Things banner die. I think it's the rounded banner. Um, really really cute and then some American crafts twine and then on the back I just have the little stamp from Hobby Lobby with my name and the date whoops excuse me so um, that is that card and I hope you guys like it I hope you guys are all having an awesome day and thanks again for stopping by and for your support it really means a lot so talk to you soon love you bye